Selecting your course for migration. In order to select your course for migration, you'll be going into ConnectU. So go ahead and log into ConnectU, and that's www.msudenver.edu. And in the upper right hand corner, you'll see the, the ConnectU. Once you're inside, you've logged in, what you're going to do is you're going to go to My Services Registration. And then again, My Services Registration. And this is going to open up a new window or a new tab. From this tab, the main menu, look at the very bottom. You're going to see the Blackboard Learn Migration. Let's go ahead and click that, and we're brought up with an option to set up your Blackboard Learn course. And this is going to be for the spring of 2014. So let's go ahead and click this Learn course. And what it presents us with is all sorts of different information. We can see previous courses that we may have selected, and we have a set of instructions here that it's important for you to read. Once you've read these instructions, what you're going to do is from the drop down, you're going to select the course that you're looking to migrate content into. So this is the spring course that you're looking to migrate content into. So from here, we'll go ahead and select a course. So once we've selected our course, we're going to go ahead and say submit. This screen now has another set of instructions that I'm going to ask you to please read. What we're doing here is looking to decide where the content is coming from. If we just want a complete blank shell and we're going to be developing everything new inside of Blackboard Learn, we want to select the blank shell build a new course option from the drop down. If we want it to come from a previous semester, the options will be available inside of this drop down. Please be careful and choose the correct course because a lot of work will go into cleaning up this course once it has been selected. Once you've made your selection choice, go down to Submit, and this actually takes us to a confirmation page that's saying that we are copying into our spring course from the course that we selected, in this case spring of 2012. And from here, if we need to make any changes, we can click here, and if not, we go ahead and Submit. This has now been locked in, and we can select another course for migration. I hope this helps.